Hello everyone and welcome to this video. Today I will show you how to create monitoring analysis using Trimble for the control. On the T4D homepage, go to analysis in the charting and analysis tab. On the left side panel, I will select add analysis. I will choose a name, let's say Xtilt. Then I will choose the analysis type. In my case, I will select a normal chart. You can select show log if you would like to show additional information on your chart like warning events. You can set the scope as a private or public. If it's set as private, it will be only viewed by the users that created it. In date range mode, you can select a fixed date range or rolling window. In my case, I will select the fixed date range and set the dates. You can enable the time window for the analysis and set your analysis start and end time. Now we are going to configure the analysis series and select the type of data that we are analyzing. In this case, it is the tilt. So I will select the tilt meter that I have already imported and click next. Now you can choose whether you like to plot the absolute or relative measurements. As I'm analyzing only the X tilt measurements, so I will choose a single column, then I will select the value that I will import from the sensor. In my case, it is the tilt A which represents the X tilt. Then I will choose if I would like to import all the epochs or the average value per day, then click next. Now I will choose the name of the analysis series, line type, color, the number of decimals, and save. Now I will go to plot band mode and choose ranges and click on save. This will give you the option to customize the background color for each value. Click on add and assign the color for each different value. By clicking on the chart icon, you can view the analysis that we just created. You can configure the scale limit for your y-axis and set the minimum and maximum value. Now we go again to add analysis to create a Windrows analysis. Set the name, then set the analysis type to Windrows and set the date range and click on save. Now click on add and select the sensor that you will use to create your chart and click next. Plot all the epochs and set the unit as project default and click done. Click on the Windows icon to view the chart. You can see the change in the Windows by selecting different dates. Now we will create a temperature analysis. Set the name to temperature and set the date range and scope as preference. And set the analyst type to comparative bar chart. This will let you compare the temperature of different sensor in different dates. Then click save. Now click add, set the data type to temperature, select multi-sensor, then set your sensor and click next.
You can change the unit decimals then click done. Click on the bar icon to view the bar chart. Now I will show you how we can create one analysis using different data types like temperature and tilt. First I will select the name then the date range for the analysis and save. Second, I will select the type and data source for my data. In this case, I will start with temperature. Then I will set the name and the line type and color for the data and click done. Now I will click on add. I will do the same as before for the tilt data. Now I will be able to visualize the temperature and tilt data in one analysis. Thank you for watching. If you have further questions, please contact Trimble Monitoring Support.